Hi everyone and welcome to this fifth episode on the Mandelbauer insanity. Quick reminder, John Mandelbauer claims that Newton's laws are wrong. In the past episodes, we showed that Newton's first and second laws successfully passed our experimental test. So today we are going to test the third law. The third law says that if a body exerts a force on another one, then the first experiences a force from the second one that is equal in magnitude and opposite in direction to the force that it exerts on the second one. In equation, the force that the first body exerts on the first one is the negative of the force that the second body exerts on the first one. In common language, we say that action equals the reaction. We can easily test this law by using two force sensors that are hooked together. When we use the left sensor to pull on the right one, the right one will measure a force. We can check whether the left one also measures a force or not, and if yes, we can measure the magnitude of that reaction force. So, let us do the experiment. I have here two identical force sensors. Let me collect some data, while I'll pull and push on the right sensor's hook. You see that it records in the top graph a positive value when I pull and a negative value when I push. Now, let me collect data again and do the same thing with the left sensor. Same thing, it records, this time in the middle graph, a positive value when I pull on the hook and a negative value when I push on it. Now let me hook the two sensors together and collect data again. You see that whatever I do, the two sensors record exactly the same thing and the bottom graph shows the forces of the two sensors, but we see only one curve. Why is that? Well, just because they are exactly the same, which comforts Newton's third law. Whenever the first force sensor applies a force onto the second sensor, the second sensor applies a force on the first sensor with the same magnitude and the opposite direction. To conclude, Newton's three laws successfully passed our test. You're wrong, Mr. John Mandelbauer. Newton's laws are perfectly well supported by experiment. Stay tuned and don't miss our next episode on the Mandelbauer insanity.